series two of this financial education. They used to say, first step towards success is willingness to listing. That's why I welcome you to this series two, where you're going to understand what we call statistics of wealth. Or in another word, you call it principle of financial freedom in this 21st century. My name once again is A.A. Moshud. There's a rule called 70-20-10% principle. 70-20% of 70-20-10% of 11 billions of the populace. The rule says 70% of people in the world they are struggling with 30% worth of the world. Why 20% are enjoying 70% worth of the world? Then 10% among others are swimming in 90% worth of the world. Now the question now is who are the 70%? Who are the 20% and who are the 10%? Now let's follow along as I explain who are the 70%. I believe you like to know these 70% of people that are struggling with 30% worth of the world. They are the people that economy of their living countries always determine or always has negative effects on their incomes. These 70% are in this category not by accident but by choice. It is what they have chosen for themselves. What are those things they have chosen for a living and why that makes them to belong in that 70%? No other things. Number one, because they choose to be a salary earner. Number two, they choose to be a shop owner of any kind. I mean, shop owner of any kind. You know, we have a case study here. The case study is worldwide pandemic that happened years back. We all witnessed very powerful negative effects of economic crisis on salary earners and shop owners during the COVID-19 lockdown. Many are yet to recover, especially shop owners. They are yet to recover till present moment. Even especially those that are selling a kind of perishable goods. No reserve of funds to withstand the economic crisis that happened that time. So that is why the 70% majorly lives in loan life size. They do start their shop, they do build their house, they do buy a car with loan, no loan, no, li no lifestyles. When salary earners are servicing car loan and house loan that they hardly earn $50 per month. So no reserve for their retirement. That is why to be part of this 70%, there's no way one can enjoy financial freedom. Success is not property of America. Poverty is not in heritage of Africa, but the product of your mind. Your mindset, time your life settings.